Today we're going to talk about the Rocket G4. So what we're standing in front of is the new Rocket G4. They are uh, 5 inch, 7 inch, 8 inch, and the 10-3. It's a 10 three-way. So what you have is, is Kevlar tweeter, Kevlar woofer. On the back, since we're on the V-Series, we started using DSP for the crossover and EQ. So to bring it over to the Rocket, we put it in an LCD. That was uh, dual function one. It looks super cool. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show it to your guys real quick after we're done with the interview so you can you know, testify to the fact like, what? That's coming out of a five inch speaker? Amazing. But it's, it's uh, I already have actual artists like Mike Dean who are use, is using the Rocket 8. Jakir King is going back to the Rockets. He, he, was, he, he mixed the Big Kings of Leon record on Rocket 5s and won a Grammy like 10 years ago and has used Rocket Fives ever since. He makes Nora Jones with them. Of course, he has other monitors he works with them, but they're basically his little monitor. So uh, I, I brought these out to him and he said, Rich, I've really come to trust the V4s. Man, you just killed it. And he put up the new Rocket Fives and he was like, okay, I need five pair. <laughs> so it's uh, super exciting. And, and I'm working with uh, like four or five artists that are actually gonna be using these to make big records, not just in home, home studio. So you can, if you're in a home studio, you can go, hey, these are for real. These are the legit deal, so. Bonjour et bienvenue chez Focal. For over 35 years, Focal has been designing and handcrafting world-renowned products in the hi-fi and professional audio industry. Driven by a quest to innovate and push the boundaries of acoustic technology, Focal is proud to introduce its latest series of professional studio monitors, the Focal Shape. Developing speaker driver cone technologies is part of Focal's core expertise. The Shape series uses the new Flax Sandwich Cone developed by Focal as a logical improvement of its polyglass technology, offering superior rigidity, increased damping and lower weight. Focal has further improved its famous inverted dome tweeter with the new M-shape design. Mechanically, the M-shape gives the dome much more rigidity, which reduces distortion and improves off-axis response. Flanking the beautiful real wood veneer cabinet, are two flat passive radiators designed to extend the low frequency response and reduce the overall cabinet size. These technologies, integrated into the new shape monitors, are a true testament to Focal's passion for acoustic innovation. Shape beyond the curve. Hi folks, I'm Klaus Heinz from Head Audio and I would like to show you what's going on here. We are in the large anechoic chamber of the Technical University of Berlin and we are going to take the ground taking measurements for our linear phase monitoring approach. We take like 40 measurements per model and we win impulse responses out of these measurements and we reverse these measurements or mirror it on the uh, frequency response axis and so have a chance to get a total linear frequency response. 
And with modern FIR filtering, we will have a linear phase response possible as well. This is something not possible with analog monitors. To take advantage of this technology, you have to go to our website where we have prepared a plugin for your DAW in all major formats. Take the impulse from the plugin, insert it in your digital audio workstation, and then lean back and listen to music, because this is music with linear frequency and phase response at a time. Nothing you have heard before. The purpose of a studio monitor is to deliver a perfectly flat and uncoloured representation of your music. I'm here today with the HS series of studio monitors. Straight away, you'll see that the HS monitors feature the recognisable white cones, which are often referred to as being very similar to the legendary NS10 monitor. The reason for this similarity is that they were actually designed by the same guy, Mr Nakamura, so they share many of the same design principles as the original NS10Ms themselves. The HS have been designed to deliver an exceptionally flat and accurate response that you would expect from a studio monitor and in keeping with the tradition of the Yamaha NS10. A practical choice for all music styles and genres. It also means that they're pretty handy speakers for many different applications, whether that be a home or project studio, education, live broadcasting, or anywhere where you just need an affordable yet accurate monitor. In terms of the design, let's take a look at the rear of these speakers. So here we can see that we have volume control at the top and we can also see that they're a rear ported design. We have XLR and jack inputs for both balanced and unbalanced connections which make them a very flexible and practical solution. And then down here we have various EQ and room controls which means that you can set up these monitors and tailor them to the environment you're mixing in. Genelec's 8000 series has become the standard in a broadcast, music and post-production world. Now, Genelec is making its professional range available to even the smallest studio spaces, OB vans, touring facilities and professionals. Genelec proudly presents the 8010A, the newest and the smallest addition to the 8000 series. It's very compact, yet truly professional. It's a two-way active monitor, which produces a lot higher sound pressure level than you would expect from a speaker this size. Both the tweeter and the woofer have protective grills, which prevents you from accidentally damaging the drivers. As with the other products in the range, there is no need for an external amplifier. The active design in the Genelec means that there is a Class D amp matched for each of the drivers. At the back, there is a rounded bass reflex board for great low frequency output again despite the size of the speaker itself. There is a full set of room response controls which will help you calibrate the speaker depending on where it's standing. If you place it on a desktop you might want to get rid of the mid-frequency boost or on the other hand if you place it in the corner of the room there will be some extra artificial bass that you can get rid of. And as you can see there is an isopod under the speaker which means we can easily set it up, tilt and angle it to an optimal listening position wherever we are. Intelligent signal sensing is fitted, which really adds to the power efficiency of the speaker. That means it will power itself off automatically if it detects no signal, and then it can switch itself back on when it detects it again. Lastly, there is a professional XLR connection and a whole range of mounting points, which means you can install it in a whole variety of different locations. And thanks to its small size and universal power supply, the AG10 is a perfect companion on a worldwide tour.